Welcome to Howard Beach. Today I'm going to share the best things to do, eat, and see here. So let's go. I'm here at Bruno's Ristorante Italiano in Howard Beach, and I have a very special guest for this video. I'm very excited. It is Robert Napolitano, the owner and broker at CapriJet Realty. So what makes this area so special, and why do you love Bruno's, most importantly? I love Bruno's because Bruno's is a staple in the neighborhood. They always make you feel at home, always greeted by friendly people and the service is fantastic. The specialty dishes were the zucchini flowers. They make them delicious here and they stuff them with a little ricotta. Stuffed zucchini. Over here at Bruno's, you get dishes that you don't find. Pasta con le sarde, which is like pasta with fish in it. Well, now you've made me very hungry, so why don't we try some of the food? Okay. We have these delicious stuffed clams here, which you said, that's the first thing you gotta try. In Italian, we say buon appetito. Buon appetito. Most restaurants don't make them because they're very difficult to make. Yeah. However, uh, when you take the time to prepare them properly, they're outstanding. This is one of the most unique things I've ever seen in a New York City restaurant. So when you're ordering your main course here, they actually bring this amazing tray of different types of meats and seafood for me to choose from. Now we're not going to be showing off their main courses today, but this is something you can experience when you come here. But for now, let's head to our next spot. So, Stelina, you grew up here in Howard Beach. Tell me, what was it like growing up here? You know, it's Queens, so it's the city, yeah. but it is a little bit more homey. It has kind of a suburban feel. Definitely. So you have, it's the best of both worlds here. Now, you are part of family business. Your yes. dad yes. is the owner of Capri Jet Realty. So what's it like being a broker in this area? It's great. Everything kind of came full circle. I was a practicing attorney for a while. Mm -hmm. Transitioned to being an associate broker because I wanted to be more involved in real estate and yes. stay in the family business. And yeah. now I get to work essentially in my backyard and my father is my boss and my mentor, so <laughs> it, that. it works. And he has such an interesting story, and I love his inspiration for starting Capri Jet Realty. Many years ago, this was a travel agency, and I knew from when I was, I'll go as far as saying a little boy, that I had to be in my own business. I get my first job as an airline. As I'm working for British Airways, Capri Jet Travel comes for sale. So, of course, I bought it. It's a no-brainer. The internet you know, takes off and when the travel business went by the wayside, it was only a natural transition for me to turn it into a real estate agent. So I got my broker's license about 20 years ago and from that point forward, it's been Capri Jet Realty. And I love it. I like helping people, especially helping families find their dream home. There's a few houses you guys are selling in this area. Could you show me one of them? Yes, I'm gonna take you inside this one right here and we'll do a quick little tour. This one is a waterfront property. There are four bedrooms, two and a half baths. You have four dock slips out there so you could fit a couple of boats, a couple of jet skis. Oh my gosh. Beautiful, right? <gasps> I can't believe I'm in New York City. This is beautiful. It's gorgeous, and there are definitely houses like this in Howard Beach. Wow, this living room is humongous. And again, the detail that they put into the ceiling, you have so many different chandeliers. This is probably the biggest couch I've ever seen in my life. Yep. So if someone wanted to buy this property, the best person to reach out to would be you. Absolutely, yes. And all of your information is on CapriJetRealty.com? Yeah. Okay, perfect. One of the things that I really love about this area is the fact that you have a canal. You don't really get that anywhere else in the city. If you go out of the canal, make a right, mm -hmm. it takes you all the way through Brooklyn and then you end up in downtown Manhattan by the Statue of Liberty. If you have a boat, you can take it to some of the restaurants and dock right outside the restaurant and go inside. Yes, and since the Capri Jet Cruiser is right there. Oh, look who's here. <laughs> do you want to go see one? Uh, yeah, let's do that. We're going. Yay, <laughs> let's go. So what other things can people do around here on the water? Oh, fishing is the main event. We fish for fluke, black sea bass, striped bass in season. Oh, very nice. See, that is what I love about this area, is the fact that you're so close to so many of the great beaches in New York, but you also have all these restaurants along the water. So where are you taking us right now? 
Right now we're going to Vetro. And across the water from Vetro is actually Charles Park. Really, really nice park. Playgrounds are there, a few tennis courts, a couple of baseball fields, and a dog park. You took us to Vetro Restaurant and Lounge. Yes. Why do you love this spot? I love Vetro's because it's a fantastic restaurant. The food is delicious. And also, it's a catering hall. This particular area that we're in, like we could have a private party in. But besides that, one floor above us, there's a catering room. And on top is a rooftop catering room where we have the Free Jet Realty's annual holiday party every year. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. And so I imagine you have some nice views of the harbor. Oh, spectacular. They have a wine cellar yes, downstairs. Yes, they have a wine cellar, yes. So we got a few dishes Absolutely. here. We got um, their octopus. This is an Italian egg roll, which you said is really good. Yeah, it's kind of like their novelty item. And you don't really hear Italian and egg roll in the no. same sentence often, but it's it's very good. Buon appetito. Mm -hmm. The main courses have arrived. We got the branzino, the salmon, and the linguine with clams. Let's try the linguine with clams. What would you say is your favorite dish here? <laughs> I have to say branzino. It's delicious. It is very flavorful. Well, thanks so much for showing me around Howard Beach, you guys. I appreciate it. Um, with your family background here, it's so interesting to have local insights. If someone wants to buy or sell their house here, what's the best way to contact you, Robert, as the owner and broker, the original guy? I'd be so happy to help you with either <laughs> buy, buying or selling Capri Jet Realty. Well, lovely seeing you. And with that, let's head to our next location in Howard Beach. Located off of Cross Bay Boulevard, you have this lovely spot. This is the Jamaica Bay Wildlife Refuge, and this is actually a national park located in New York City. Did you even know that was possible? Here you're going to find 12,000 acres of salt lands, marshes. They actually have over 300 different types of birds here and lots of other animals in this region. You can see behind me, we have some beautiful swans in a gorgeous little lake. Now here is a great spot for a picnic. You can actually do a little walk around the pond. Uh, you can also see signs of New York City in the distance. You know, sometimes when you're in such natural beauty like this, it's so easy to forget that you're in New York. But one of the unique things about Howard Beach is even though you're still in New York City, you still have access to all of the natural beauty of New York State. And that's really what I love about this. The staple of the neighborhood is here. This is Saul's Food Market, and this has been here since 1946. This is a spot you want to go if you want to get a really good deli sandwich. They also have amazingly fresh meats and all different types of staples for dining at home. Cross Bay Boulevard is the main street here in Howard Beach, and this is where you're going to find all of the restaurants, bars, stores. We also have great health care in this area. They have an urgent care that is super convenient for those that live here, and also even an autism center. Now, Cross Bay Boulevard is actually located right along the canal, which is why Howard Beach is sometimes referred to as the Venice of New York City. One of the most convenient things about Howard Beach is how close it is to JFK, which is one of the main airports in New York City. So if you love traveling, this is an awesome place for you to live because you can get anywhere in the world pretty much on a direct flight from JFK Airport. This is actually the JFK Airport shuttle right here. Uh, you take that, you're gonna be at JFK in 20 minutes. Or if you drive, it's only a nine minute drive. It really doesn't get more convenient than that. Thanks so much for joining us in Howard Beach. Now, if you like this video, check out our other guides to different neighborhoods in New York City. We'll see you next time.